You could read a full article in the description below because I'm not doing it. However, I can't actually state a few things that Shuei hey, Yosuke actually said. He actually said that he they got a lot of work to do to actually bring more first-party games to the PS4. Now, a lot of people m mistake um, third-party games that is actually exclusive on the PS4, like, let's say, Persona and Tales of Zeteria. Those are third-party uh, exclusive games. First-party games, like in-house developer games, like Killzone, Uncharted, or games like, um, let's see, Killzone, Uncharted, Little Bit Planet, Dry Club, Gran Turismo, stuff like that. You know, they won't ask or last of us. Or if you look at the actual Xbox Halo Gills, you know, stuff that just literally is by they a company that Sony owned. That's what they looking for. And they looking for more games like that. Before somebody say, But they got all these JRPGs coming out. Yeah, but Bandai and Netcom making the most of those JRPG or Atlas or Atlas Sega. But um well but anyway. So, he was actually stating that, you know, it's hard to actually get those type of games because they get, you know, they get overlooked where your console is actually doing real well. Meaning, it's doing so hot, the third party people or the third party developers actually putting more efforts and time into Sony while they, the first party game get overlooked because people want to play, you know, like, shit. Damn, I can't even think of a game. I'm so sleepy. But anyway, they like Call of Duty. They want to play Call of Duty or NBA 2K or Metal Gear Solid. You know, like, oh, we playing these games. And they're like, oh, look, a new game came out for Sony. What's that? Until Dawn. <laughs> Fuck that damn game. That's that practically what's going on. And he said they could get overlooked. And you know what? Well, actually, sell as hot. Unless your console is not doing real well, that means your software will pick up. Look at Nintendo, Splatoon, or any Mario they make, or Zelda. It starts selling a little bit well. And it's, it's kind of crazy how that actually worked, but hopefully they can actually pick it up. He also said that he's looking forward to the actual VR and see how that's going to do. I personally, I don't think I'm going to actually invest my money in that. Depending on what that shit going to cost. It might look good in that new apartment now if I could get. Got that damn thing in there, just chilling. <sighs> no kids. I might have fun with that damn thing. Who knows? I wonder if that shit coming porn. Hopefully, but anyway, it's it's crazy that a lot of people are actually point out that it barely have any first party well, first party games. The last time, well, this year they came out with three of them. They came out with Tales of Dawn, the Order eighteen eighty six, and Bloodborne. That's three. Now I forgot what did they exactly came out with in two thousand fourteen. Little Bit Planet. Believe and Infinite Second Son and Dry Club. That's three that year too. And then when it first came out, so I'm at six now. When it first came out, they had um Killzone and Knack. So what they had that eight eight exclusive first party games. That's not good enough. They need a little bit more. We know we got a around a, a ride Ground Zero coming out. And that's the only one I could actually think of that is screws with the two PS4 that actually come from an actual PS4 developer. Cause I know people say, but they got Star Ocean and it's it's still it's still not in house development. That's what they talking about. Even though personally I don't give a fuck about that, to be honest with you. My favorite games is literally party like usually the third party exclusive like Tales and Persona. If they have Final Fantasy still exclusive or you know, Kingdom Hearts. Those third party games are usually what I actually play on PS4 or PlayStation platform usually. The after is crucial like God of War, for instance. I like God of War and Uncharted. That's uh, infamous. Those are like the only fucking three to be honest with you. Other than that, like shit like Killzone and Grab Turismo, just not my thing. And um Oh yeah, and the last of us. I like I like the last of us, but they only been one game with that. Hopefully we get a part two of that soon. So we still see how this is gonna actually go. But so far I'm enjoying my PS4 with just the third party game, the third party exclusives. The next game I'm getting it tells us hysteria. So I can that shit day one. I don't care if that shit get a two. I'm getting that shit day one. But anyway, tell you guys thank me, share, rate, comment, and subscribe. I'm out of here. Peace.